Master Cormac, what you have learned from Le Chasseur was confirmed. The local lawbreakers are changing tactics. What's their plan now? Their boss has hired Benjamin Franklin to produce new weapons for them. He's very well guarded. Benjamin Franklin? The scientist? You have heard of him. Good. He is making a... Something to hide. Someone should go after Don't him. Don't get you. Anyone? I'll keep up with you. He's just a normal man. He's bound to tire. Get <laughs> him away. Must I do everything here? Keep up with you. He's getting away. Must I do everything here?
Shay, oh, it is good to see you again. Your friend Hope said you were away. I, I, I was. Uh, sir, I, I've come to collect the results of your experiments. Oh, well, it's a very good thing, then. I just finished fixing the prototype. Here you go. I was preparing to leave for Philadelphia, and then Europe. I was invited to lecture in London. Oh, would you be so kind as to inform Mistress Hope? Uh, of course. God, Hope. What are you doing with these felons? Turning the city against itself. What have you become? Something the matter, Master Cormac? Uh, no, no. Yes, just... old memories. When I am issued new recruits, burdened with regrets, I tell them the surest way to lose them is with gunpowder. You're right, Colonel. This prototype seems very powerful. Use it with care, Master Cormac. Our intelligence says this thing can destroy certain fortifications, as well as injure several enemies at once. There is also a more subtle way to use it. Some of these grenades contain a strong sedative. Fire one into the crowd and they will fall asleep immediately. We should test this new weapon. Use it against that door. Use these grenades to destroy that door. Go ahead, Master Cormac. Shoot the 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 door. Good work. Good work. I think you are ready to turn this new weapon against the ruffians who would have used it. There is an abandoned factory nearby hiding a dangerous poison. Right now, it only causes sleep. But I fear those outlaws are distilling it. A more powerful form of But not my first target. Be careful. We understand that we believe it's highly unstable. All the better.
Stay away! This is dangerous! You really think we can't catch you? <laughs> mess with this. Maybe I can break the whole system. Why? Too much tension between the English. You could stand to look a little more respectable. I had the most extraordinary dream last night. What about? I was wearing a nice frock and dancing in a posh cafe. Thank <laughs> you. 
here. Must get out, or I'm as good as dead. The whole place will blow up. If you want to pass by me. Let us drown you. Ready to open I fire. him in my sights. Don't give him the satisfaction of slipping away. Find him again. What marvelous destruction, Captain. I saw the smoke all the way from the Morrigan. That should discourage those miscreants. New York is safe for now. With all due respect, Colonel, it's going to take more than a few explosions to get rid of this kind of trouble. The boy is right, Colonel Monroe. Shay, was it? Congratulations. You just burned the whole lot of rats out of New York. I'm Jack Weeks. This is William Johnson. I don't know about him, but I'm pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. It is uh, terribly dusty here. I'm sure Shea can recount his adventures to us over a pint. Hey, the first round's on uh, the Colonel. Huh? <laughs> is something the matter, Master Cormac? Just a little confused. I uh, must have breathed some of that gas. Some ale will do you good. Come, we are all friends here. You will be taken care of. Dear Master Cormac, my apologies for the brevity of this missive, but it is time we were honest with one another. You have demonstrated your loyalty and resourcefulness to the Templar cause, and this despite and perhaps because of your assassin origins. The manuscript the assassin sought has been in my possession for some time. I reclaimed it when my men found you marooned. The Grand Master himself charged me to discover its meaning, a task I regret I have failed to complete. I leave it in your charge, Master Cormac. 
There is no one else I trust more. Now I leave for Fort William Henry, an ill-prepared garrison surrounded by hostile natives and the French army. We have requested reinforcements, but I doubt they will be forthcoming. I have no illusions that our resistance will be successful. I commit my life to the British Army and my soul to the Father of Understanding. Yours, Colonel George Monroe. Captain Colonel, it's the wheel! Find your post, guest. The Colonel's in trouble. How do you mean, in trouble? He's at Fort William Henry, facing impossible odds. Get off your lazy asses, lads, and man your stations! We raise anchor! Sorry for the early libation, Captain. But do you realize that it's been a whole year since we met? <laughs> a whole year! Changed my life, you did. And for the better. <laughs> you will uh, forgive me if I have been uh, celebrating without you. A whole year. Guest. Question for you. How long have you known of my, well, former allegiance? Oh, the assassins. I knew that ages ago, Shane. I may be drunk, but I'm not. some homicidal circus. Captain has the help! Get me! Why didn't you say anything? Well, the Colonel wanted us to avoid the subject so it wouldn't, you know, influence your decision-making. You saved my life out of pure selfless instinct and helped countless others besides. If it were up to me, I would have made you an official Templar months ago. Who is it up to then? Monroe mentioned the Grand Master. Oh, yes. The Grand Master of the Colonial. What is the news of Fort William Henry? The garrison is surrounded, and reinforcements are late. General Montcalm has been blazing a path across the colonies for King Louis, hasn't he? I rather wish he'd stayed home with his mistress. His or King Louis's? Either. Though I suspect the King's is finer. Indeed. Madame O'Murphy is supposed to be quite the charmer. I know Murphy is in the French King's bed. Now I know you're pulling my leg. Don't forget your old shipmate. Rally, 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 rally,
fish tail from Plymouth Town. Oh, he has gone a night. Jack was there and her tummy is now such as you and I, Jack. Don't be tossed on the rolling lake. Now we're safe ashore, Jack. Don't forget your old chimney. Rolly, 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 rolly. We have worked the soft safe gun for the deck division. Wonder I and load a you through the whole commission. Don't be tossed on the rolling lake. Now we're safe ashore, Jack. Don't forget your old chimney. Rolly, 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 rolly. Soil. I call the dreary body in this empire. And all of me money it was spent. spent, spent. And where it went, I swear I can't remember. <laughs> so down to the shipping office I went. <laughs> the paddy lay back. Take it. 